In this video, we'll write the balanced net ionic equation for ZnCl2 plus NH42S. This is zinc chloride. This is ammonium sulfide. The first thing we need to do with net ionic equations, we have to balance the molecular equation. This is the molecular equation. I can see that I have two chlorine atoms here and just one here. So I'm going to put a two in front of the ammonium chloride. That balances the chlorines. I have two ammonium ions, but that's good. I have two ammonium ions here and I have one zinc and one sulfur on each side. So this is the balanced molecular equation. Now we can write the state for each substance. If you know your solubility rules, chlorides, very soluble. So AQ, this will dissolve, dissociate into its ions. Ammonium compounds, very soluble. AQ as well. But sulfides in general are insoluble. Zinc sulfide is insoluble. These two substances react, they produce the zinc sulfide, which is insoluble. So it's a solid, doesn't dissolve, falls to the bottom of the test tube as a precipitate. So we have our precipitate here, and this is a precipitation reaction. Ammonium compounds, chlorides, very soluble, AQ. Now we can split the strong electrolytes into their ions for the complete ionic equation. So zinc is always two plus, and the chloride ion always one minus. So we have the zinc ion, and I won't write the states now. Let's do that at the end. Two chloride ions, and the ammonium ion, this is a good one to remember, one plus. So we have our ammonium ion, sulfide, two minus. So two of these ammonium ions, NH4 plus, and then we have just the sulfide ion, S2 minus. And these are the reactants in our net ionic equation. For the products, we don't split solids apart. So we just have zinc sulfide. And then we have the ammonium ion and then the chloride. So we have two ammonium ions, just like in the reactants, and then two of these chloride ions, also like the reactants. So now we have our complete ionic equation. We can cross out spectator ions. They're on both sides of the complete ionic equation. They haven't changed, so we're really not interested in them. In the reactants, I can see there are two chloride ions, and here in the products, two chloride ions, spectator ions. We cross those out, <laughs> and I don't know why I put the four up here. Let's put it down here. This is NH4+. Plus. So I have two ammonium ions here, and then in the products, I have two ammonium ions. Cross those out, they're spectator ions. But what's left, that's the net ionic equation for ZnCl2 plus NH42S. I'll clean this up and write the states. We'll have our net ionic equation. So this is the balanced net ionic equation for zinc chloride plus ammonium sulfide. You'll note charge is balanced, two plus, two minus, net charge of zero here in the reactants. This is a neutral compound in the products, net charge is zero. So we have the same charge on each side. If you count the atoms up, they're balanced as well. This is Dr. B with the balanced net ionic equation for ZnCl2 plus NH42S. Thanks for watching.